Y'all, it's hot. It's 82 degrees and it feels like 95. Please, let's... Uh. Oh, I I really I've been well, drinking beer, so don't be, gotta be real careful. Cause the same thing will happen when we get me. Who said that? Who said that? Who said that? Who closed that? Niece, cause it was beaming down. Okay, bye guys. Your distraction. I have to go. This, we're here with pops. We're driving. So hold up, here come Brenda. Hold up, I don't want you to run her over. I'm gonna run her over. I'm gonna run her over. Run her over. So, I could have died red death all the time. A boy could hit five people. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, all you look behind. See Does she? Um, she's Tom's wife? Coming this way. Is that Tom's wife? No. That's Brenda. Hey guys, we're back at the house and and we I got uh we got city barbecue if you don't know what that is. I don't know, is that a Midwest thing? City barbecue? I don't know, but it's a barbecue spot, it's a barbecue joint, and I just had to be different and got a Nashville chicken hot sandwich without the coleslaw and some macaroni. Mm-mm-mm. We're just gonna try it. We're just gonna try it. Definitely dry. Just as I thought. Trash. No flavor whatsoever. Uh, <laughs> Fox, what do you have to say to people who just heard that? That loud oh, gas bar. What's an overrated snack? Forget that. There, there's no such thing as an overrated snack because a snack is a snack. But the most underrated snack. I'm with the banana. No. What do you want? Uh, you can have it. No, you can. Have it. The most underrated snack, y'all. As I'm editing, um, I don't even know why I was continuing to eat the nasty, stale macaroni and cheese. I guess I was trying to find hope. You know when you try. <laughs> The, the nasty mac and cheese from uh, City Barbecue. <laughs> it was dry and tastes like cotton balls. Um, <laughs> but I don't know. I guess like when you try, like when you get something and it's nasty, you keep eating to get hope, hoping it to taste good as you eat it. But no, baby, it wasn't that. Oh, good. Okay, here's the sandwich. Like, I could have made this at home. Anyways, so I'm gonna be telling a story time what happened to me today, literally a few hours ago. I wake up from a missed call from a 701 number. Okay, well. The only people I know that's in Bismarck, North Dakota, I have their number saved. So I'm like, okay, who gave my number away? What's happening? So I call them back and she goes, Oh, this is Kelsey from my bank. And I'm like, okay. And she goes, um. Your account is overdrawn. Would you like to take care of that or you need a payment plan? Payment plan? Overdrawn. What? So I go on the mobile app and see like how much is overdrawn. Why does it say thirteen hundred dollars negative? First of all, I don't even have thirteen hundred dollars to spend. It was so crazy. I literally wanted to melt. I literally wanted to disintegrate. So I'm, I called her back. I'm like, uh, I don't know what's going on, but. Listen, something needs to happen because I'm not in charge of this. More of the story, somebody, somebody hacked my account and be careful when you're out. I don't know. Be, be safe and be careful. Not to mention all of the transactions were coming from Microsoft. 
Like, I don't even use Microsoft. But then she goes, well, you know, Microsoft comes from Xbox and PlayStation and game consoles. I don't even play Xbox or PlayStation. Yeah, let's dispute this money right now. That's why I didn't eat when I got up because I was so mind boggled that I didn't even want to eat. My mouth wouldn't even open for a spoonful of nothing. So I'm really thinking about taking out my hair because it's been almost a month, which it don't look that bad, but I'm just tired of it. I'm tired, I'm tired. Do I really want to take it out? Oh no. I want to take it out, but I don't want to keep having to worry about my hair. Like I don't want to keep having to maintain it. That's not what I want to do. I could keep it in and just leave it alone and be basic and boring, or I could take it out have a nice good old twist out and have to deal with it. So pick your fight, Philip. I think it's time. The roots are like, I don't know if I can see the roots, but the roots are like, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like Q-tips, like cotton balls. Cotton ball roots. I'm gonna trademark that so nobody can use it. Please, should I take out my hair? I really don't want to have to twist my hair again. Well, I'm gonna do it anyway, cause that's how I am. I, I'm gonna take it out. I'm taking it out. We're 20 minutes later and my hair is taken out and I hate it. I don't like it, I don't know. I'm. It used to be different. It used to be so much different when I took out my hair from twist and now it, it just don't feel the same. Mm, no, but I don't like it. I really don't like it that much. I guess because I'm used to my hair and, and twist, but. So we're about to go to the movies. Yay. And we're about to go see the black phone. I've been wanting to see that for the longest. And finally I get to see it. Just gonna see what it's about. I heard it was a good movie. And now we have to see it for ourselves. But yeah. Show them your outfit. Tell them your outfit. <laughs> <laughs> sure. So I'm looking tacky today, so but we just going to the movie. Right. No, but get into the get into the drip. Dapper Dan. That's him. Well, what's this thing called? The black phone. The black phone. What's it about? Uh getting kidnapped, which is my worst fear. Yes, anybody. Come on. Pull a van beside you and throw you in a van and keep it pushing. Yeah. Before we go real quick, let me show y'all outfit of the day. Oh, uh, my grandma got new furniture and it's so nice. I love it. I have to pick it out. Okay, uh, bag from Coach, glasses from Amazon, shirt from Goodwill, pants from Walmart, shoes from Journeys. So we're at the movies and of course I can't film in the movie. So I'm gonna let y'all know how the movie is. It's supposed to be scary, but when I saw the trailer, it looked I don't know, it just looks like kids getting kidnapped. I don't know. It, it's more creepy than scary. You know those the, you know those scary movies that claim they're scary, but they're really like weird and like sci-fi. I think it, that's how it's gonna be, but I, I'll let y'all know, bye. Y'all, the movie was so good. The movie was so good. I was rooting for poor little Finny. And then, boom, he escaped. Gwenny, the, her, his sister, she was, yeah. Kudos to her, hats off to her. That's how the movie had me, it was like. It was one of those. It was not really scary though, but it was like, how can people be that so sick in the mind? Like, I wonder if that was based off true events. I don't know, but it, it was a good movie. So we're in the Popeye's line and I don't know, she being real at the mouth, we'll see what happens. Here you go, you have a good one. Okay, thank you. Got a senior discount. Okay. Uh, Pops goes, uh, do you guys take military discount? And the lady didn't say anything. 
And so Pops goes, I can't hear you. She goes, okay. <laughs> Look, do you want a job or not? I will reach over this counter, please do not. Anyway, but we got our food. He got the senior discount. He didn't get military though, but yeah. I don't know, but these fries good and crunchy. Remember when people were fighting over this? Having heart attacks over this sandwich? Anyway. So we just got Chick-fil-A and this is my first time getting a strawberry uh, milkshake and they didn't do it for me. Uh, out, wait, out here? I love how I just like bashed the whole milkshake, but spell that out. indeed uh, I tore it up. There's a horrific scene in the um, Somebody on TikTok asked me like, why is my eye like this or what happened to my She's eye? Liberal, and honestly, um, yeah, I couldn't they, even they tell you what's wrong with my eye. And that is I, a if I push term, it, it's about total control. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with my to, eye, but you know, I can see perfectly they, fine. They, 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 this? I gave my chicken sandwich to Denise because I, I was full. We're skinny today, so. Okay. So we're about to go driving. Uh, we're driving across this dam which is like so exciting i don't know why it's exciting but i don't know I, I don't know if it's because i'm like i'm i'm a beginner driver and it's like everything every anytime i get in the car it's like happy go lucky it got hot super fast <laughs> it got hot super fast and uh i wouldn't have worn this if I knew it was going to be this hot, but since I already have it on, I'm not taking it off. So, mm, let's get in the car. Baby, I just need your sniffing area. Yeah, I've probably been dreading to take me driving for the longest. He's been procrastinating. So where y'all been, uh, huh? Jay Max or? Went to Nisa's dentist appointment. Oh, you did? Yeah, and then we went to um, Home Goods. You want to put the air on or what? Yeah, let's turn this air on. <laughs> oh, don't let that fall, please. I'm trying not to. Okay, shit. <laughs> you got your permit? No. Stay right here. I tell you, just pull, 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 that, pull, pull over on the curb. Y'all yeah, left my permit, so I have to run in and get it. Can you stop that? Can you hit the stop button on the camera? On the camera. Right here? Yep. Okay, slow up. You just going too fast. Watch this little boy right here. You want to get run over? No, don't start that, man. Don't play, don't play like that. <clears throat> we just got back from a walk and I'm sweating. And just so y'all, just just so I can prove to y'all, because people, because some people just think I walk just for the film, just for the aesthetic of it. But no, we're really fitness king out here. A mile and 70. I don't know how to read that, but for 35 min for 35 minutes 131 calories or 95 I don't know yeah 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 we was really running just as i thought trash <laughs>